people welcome back to Bill's Cichlid Room got these videos like buses aren't they I don't do one for two months and then there's three in just over a week so I've been there uh, getting back into the fish as you can probably tell by the number of videos uh, all the maintenance is all up to date uh, I've been cleaning all the sponge filters doing all the water changes on all the tanks uh, so today I thought we'd have a look at the rainbow cichlids which is the Herial Tilapia multispinosa a couple of pairs of Nikiragu Nikiagu Gwen cichlids that I've got and the Crypto Hair Ospilius. So hope you enjoy. But this is the tank with the rainbow cichlids and a pair of Nikiragu Gwens. Now some of you might recognise this. This is the male that I got over from uh, Max Cichlids. Uh, probably about three and a half, four years ago now. Um, I actually, I did give it to Paul Needham. Uh, he had them for oh, about six months or so, but he needed space, so he's actually uh, <laughs> given back. So yeah, he's back in Bill's cichlid room, uh, and he's got a female, so this was one of the females that Paul had. So, do the fish in here, that's the uh, Amitalania sequoia. I've only got the one of those, so it's in this tank so that it doesn't get cross-bred with, uh, with any of the other Amatelanias. We have the rainbow cichlids, as you know, this is one of my favourite fish. I do love the coloration in them. So I've just finished doing the water change on this one, put a bit of flake food in for them, just so that they can settle down. Yeah, the tank's looking much better. Yeah, trying them out a little bit. It's always a difficult tank to film this, because I've got one of the grow out tanks there, so you can't see a big, big portion of it. Yep, the rainbow cichlids and one of the pairs of Nicaragua Gwens. But this is the other pair of Nicaragua Gwens and the pair of Spilaris with a couple of youngsters that are still there. So all I've done is left the um, the Spilaris to to like raise them in here. They did have a lot more obviously and like they've been picked off over time. But yeah, the Nicaragua Gwens pair looking fantastic. So yeah, the, every bit as good as the other ones. The only difference is that this male isn't an F1. But yeah, the colours in the female, she's fantastic. Yeah, so, so this is the female Spilaris, you can tell, because she's got the spot in the dorsal fin. The male, he's a bit bigger, a bit more butch looking and hasn't got the spot in the door, so fantastic fish these. When, when you think, they, they were about the size of the youngsters when I first got them. So yeah, they've grown on really well. So Crypto Hero Spilius and the Nicaragua Gwens. So today's video had more of a Central American feel to me. So on the next one, we'll have a look at some South American cichlids. See you all soon.